Our next piece is a poem that uh, I dedicate to Diane and Jerry Rothenberg, fellow poets and eaters. Nicole Parafit and Pierre Joris, each in their own way, tell of how rabbit and hare was and is best dealt with, both here in the New World and back there in the Old. Our rabbit left this tentative scratchings in the top margin. Who knows what the irregular plural of the points to? Could be the propagational speeds the creature is known for, could be its many incarnational variations in Darwinian space. It runs at continental drift, its strong zigzag back legs, jumping off points for tales of old. O oh, Pulke, Aztec moon god, O oh, Coney Island of our bellies, O oh, you, the meat of whose fully developed fetus was classified like eggs as no meat by the church in the Middle Ages, thus letting monks eat you on fasting days. Oh, but what did this rabbit leave? Or why not right there and then gnawing itself through the top margin and thus out of the picture of the menu, though we will not eat you that way, always already a la carte. Whichever one is dealt you, the eater or the eaten, an N for an R, a hen for a hare, in Nicole's Pyrenean aspiration, in this our Darwinian alphabet soup, I eat, you are eaten, my bunny, my rabbit, my mother used to call me Hirsien, little hare, that was in Europe, where at least one discrimination has survived the confusions. A rabbit is not a hare, and vice versa. And on our nursery walls, Dura's hare stared into space till the fox caught up, and the two real pet rabbits I left to starve to death in teenage forgetfulness, a comic flaw bound to come back and haunt me in the form of my next incarnation, a wild hare darting through woods till 100 hard huffing pellets of birch heart spin its seven salto mortales. Oh, little zigzag god of the impossible flight, Oh, little god of zigzag handwriting, like those tall, hieratic Egyptian zoomorphs, you too will be prepared for the long trip. You will hang for two days in a cool room in your coat, a bard or third all of slow intestinal decomposition. My mouth already waters. Grandfather always said, use only the very best bottle of burgundy. At least three nights you will lie in, a, in it. O oh, soused hair of my zigzag mind, with your head left on, they now call you Huizen Civi, and ceremoniously count three shallots, one carrot, three cloves of garlic, one parsley root, one sage leaf, some thyme, laurel, good olive oil, black pepper, three or four cloves, some tarragon, into this marinade, this brine of the rest of your life for our delight. You will rest all night in the fridge next to the cup holes, your blood mixed with vinegar. Oh, zigzag Jesus hair, you who had the worst uphill racer in zoomorphdom and should have known better. Every few hours I turn your limbs in the fragrant herbal wine and will try to forget my little zigzag self in brine, Manhessian, for three days in the morgue of our appetites. Now bacon browns in a cast iron pot, in go your cold and soaked limbs, brown well, a glass of armagnac at hand, a swig for the cook, a match for you, little brother. Oh, what a zigzag roller coaster, this stygian journey from bed. You'll be calmed with a rain of flour, then moistened again with brine. Add it poco a poco. Some cover you now with a slice of white bread, meant, they say, to keep the sauce from coagulating. Ninety minutes on a low fire. And you're done, your limbs come to rest on a white platter. Your blood and chopped raw liver now blended with fresh cream. 
add some of the sauce and other glass of armagnac. Now the rest of the sieved sauce, carefully stir it all together and off the fire and the pieces added, the zigzag legs, the sexy saddles that were then and there my grandfather long ago called back by the rabbit gods, we now live where they don't tell hairs from rabbits, but our appetites are not diminished. We will eat two rabbits for one hair. This is zigzag America, after all, it has old, it has new things, it has the bitter, it has the rich. And here now, read how Brother Rabbit is done in our house. Our rabbit left us, and Nicole did this which she names after the date of his invention, Conejo 25 de Abril, serves four. Cut the rabbit into five pieces. If it's bigger, more pieces, but that's the saddle. Sometimes the saddle is meager, so you just do five pieces. And you're sure, make sure you eat the saddle which the French call la rable. Set them aside. Soak one toasted chili pasilla in half a cup of dark Mexican beer, dos equis. In a sauteed pan, two chopped medium onions until they are golden. Then add one cup of chopped sun-dried tomatoes, not rehydrated, very important. Mix them well with your wooden spoon and keep stirring until onions pick up the color of tomatoes. Now add eight Kalamata olives, pitted and very roughly chopped. Mix it up and let the ingredients saute for a few minutes. It is now time to add one can of tuna fish. Yes, solid in water. Stir up, remove from the fire. Stir, Stir up. Retrieve the soaking chili pasilla, cut stem and drain. Chop into pieces and work in the mortar as a paste incorporating four de-germ, thus belch free cloves of garlic. When your paste is smooth, add half of the sauteed onion mixture poco a poco and make it into a paste. Thin the paste with another half a cup of Dos Equis, if you haven't drink it, open another bottle. This whole thing could be done in a food processor and would probably take a tenth of the time. The taste, however, seems to be affected by the mechanical procedure. Now comes my favorite part. In a Dutch oven skillet, heat three tablespoons of duck fat. Everybody has duck fat in their kitchen, right? or as a good substitute, three tablespoons of virgin olive oil. When bien chaud, bien hot, throw in the rabbit and golden eat it all the sides. Then flambe with a little tequila. Smell, mix well, smell, mix well, smell. Add the chili texture, mixture, mix well again, smell again. Add the onion mixture, mix well, smell again, another cup of beer or two. You will be the judge of the consistency and then cook at feu doux, très petit feu. Let's simmer, petit simmer, for at least two hours. Check it once a while, smell it all the time. Do not turn the fan of your kitchen on. Let the fumes take over the house. Serve in the cooking pot with a steaming dish of quinoa. This is Conejo 25 the Abri. Really good. Are you getting hungry? Now let's check the soup for us.